what I want, what I see right now is a community standing up, standing up in solidarity with, with the Fushan family. This is a great example that we have to follow. You're giving us, you're leading the way at showing us what solidarity and compassion is. Thank you very much for that. I think I'm, yes. The, what I would like to say is that we, and I say we because I have a team that work with me, and I work with the community. We, with you, I have tabled a petition demanding that the Fushan family stays in Canada. Also, as we have continued to do, is we have written letters to make sure that the Minister of Immigration, as well as the Minister of um, uh, Public Safety, is aware of the plight of the Fushan family and the very stressful situation that they are living right now. I'm returning in the House of Commons tomorrow, and I will continue to stand up to make sure that this government understand that they cannot put family that wants to stay in Canada, that seek refuge in Canada, that they cannot close their door on them. We fear for the safety of the family. We want them to stay because that's what they ask, seeking refuge in our beautiful country. And in solidarity with you, I will raise my voice in the House of Commons tomorrow for you. Je veux vous remercier sincèrement de votre appui aujourd'hui pour la famille Foucham. Je vous remercie, vous démontrer au Canada comment une communauté peut se lever en solidarité et en pa par compassion. Vous démontrez réellement les valeurs que nous partageons tous, les valeurs qui font en sorte qu'on va tendre la main à notre voisin et faire en sorte qu'ils puissent rester ici, vivre en sécurité élever leurs enfants ici. Alors, merci d'être là, de démontrer, de montrer l'exemple pour tout le Canada. Merci.